Just want to say a warm welcome to our brand new head of youth development, Andrei Shevchenko. Not bad, right? Obviously, I edit it just in case anybody's going, oh, I treat. You know, this is the fun save. Because we wanted a good youth development to help our youth system. Obviously, like, you know, numbers are important. But as, as I read in the comments and stuff, personality is like one of the big things um, and also how they play and everything like that. And Ukrainians watching, do not panic. I didn't steal him away from the international job. He was unemployed, okay? So don't think I just stole away the national manager to be head of youth development of a non-league side. That would be a dick move. But welcome to the club. We've had the youth intake preview and it's pretty spicy. Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome back. So here is our youth intake preview. This is good. We like attacking midfielders. We definitely need another striker. Goalkeeper's fine. Yeah, but apparently four strikers. But there's looks like to be like one very good. But then we saw this last time and it didn't even add up. It didn't remotely match what we actually got. So with a large handful of salt, we'll look at that. As for the football, it's just gone downhill a bit, to be honest. Um, it's still good. We're battling it out with Truro currently, who just... I think they smashed us 3-0. They look quite good. Although we did beat Boreham Wood 3-1. So that's nice. Um, couple of things. We've, we're losing a couple of players. I say losing. I'm shoving them out the door. Um, Dean Brett is leaving us um, on the 1st of January because we just don't play him now. We've got upgrades. We've got another person that can take free kicks and stuff. So it's not really important. Um... And somebody else left. <laughs> Is it this one? <clears throat> Can't even remember. I think it was that one. Um, he's gone. Uh, just to get rid of the wages. Uh, however, uh, McGonagall's not only dropped off form-wise, just dropped off a bit of a cliff, to be honest. Then got injured. Tiffany Wetpants has now gone 20 games. Never scored a goal yet. 20 games. It's actually quite impressive because... I feel like being a striker existing on the pitch, there's the chances that a ball's just going hit to you, hit you and go in without you even knowing at this point, 20 games in. So we brought back Falco, because I completely forgot we still had him because he was transfer listed and loan listed, but just nobody wanted him and stuff. So he was in the under 23. So we brought him back and he actually scored in the cup game. Um, today will be Tiffany Wetpants. Arguably final chance to score today. We're playing in the FA Trophy um, as for the rest, Hurley's dropped down. He's only getting 7.61 key passes per game now. It's a little bit disappointing. To be honest, this whole season is based on the centre-backs. They've both played really well, solid defensive, both getting a few goals, and that's where a lot of Hurley's assists has come from, obviously. Um, but they are propping up the side. Even the got Bridgeberg's fallen out of form a little bit. As soon as he was wanted, I think Millwall... They haven't bid, but they've you know started sniffing around, and he's his form's just dropped off a cliff. Um, we even bought Bozzy back from the uh, under twenty threes just to get a bit of game time at left back, uh, but he's about as bad as he was the first time around. So, <laughs> but hopefully, we've got two players. I, I okay, yes, I'm sorry, I bid for Wolf again. Okay, and he turned me down. Okay, uh, but we've gone for Alex Samuel now. I'm going to be paying him 600 quid, but also there's another bid, so he'll probably he'll probably go somewhere else. Um, but like his technicals aren't the best, but the physicals are still like monstrous. I still think he'd tear it up at this level. Um, so that's good. If he doesn't come, we're going to go for John McGlynn, um, little ginger fella, who's sort of shit aversion really. <laughs> like still good player, like definitely an upgrade on Tiffany. No offense, Tiff, if you're watching but you haven't scored a goal in 20, so you've got no real, you know, it's not like I'm not giving you a chance. You're averaging 6.52. Right, but so we had to, we've delayed that because I'd rather have Alex Samuel, but if it happens, then if, it, if he goes somewhere else, then we'll get him. <clears throat> right, come on, Tiff. This is it on YouTube. Time to make you famous, yeah? Okay, sick and tired of getting back. All right, we've only lost two, in a, two games in a row. Jesus uh, they are sitting third in the same league as I, uh, in the North version. Come on, boys. Come on, Tiff. It's all about Tiffany. <clears throat> right, Hurley. 
Just we'll just take goals from corners. Okay, it's different. Matt Roberts, Denham. Lovely call. Yes! And Crane has even started playing well. He's performing pretty well. He's got goals, he's got assists. He's performing as well as Paddy. Let's go. Come on, Tip. This is actually Tiffany. No, shh, don't spook her. But she's on. Okay, she's gone to six points. Still one of her best performances this season. 6.6. .6. You've got this, Tiff. 6.5. Okay, come on. Bring it back up, Tiff. Bring it back up. You're sitting at your sort of average now. 6.4. Okay, just. <laughs> oh, that looks on. Easy, easy for Bridgeburg. You can't say I haven't given you a chance, Tiff. Okay. I'm, I'm still... She's... Go, go, even if I sell her tomorrow, I want her to get a goal before she goes. Right? She's going to get a goal. I will will it to have... I will, will will it into being. Okay. And Matt Roberts, who sort of... He's only 16. I didn't really plan to start playing him. Um, but he's developing quite nicely. And... I scored a couple of goals. Absolute flukes. Like, shit, terrible shots that just, like, the goalkeeper's awful. Like, there's... He gets no credit for the goals he scored. <laughs> 6.3 for Tiff. <clears throat> Go on, Tiff. Oh, cheeky! <laughs> Out of nowhere, little skill move. Oh, early fires one in. wonder if Tiff will get a point one for that. For that little cheeky pass. Okay. Try to advance forward. 6.2. <laughs> Actually one of the worst. Oh, 6.1. Actually one of the worst players I've ever seen. Or well, back up to 6.2. So it's a late rally. Uh, my right back is absolutely dead. He's quite defensive. He can fill in. He'll do a job. It's fine. Ten minutes left. 6.1. Stay above a six. 6.2. Hang on. You know, if the game had gone another six hours, she could have got back up to 6.5. You know? Strong finish. This is a proper highlight, though. Go on, Tiff. Go on, Crady. Find Tiff. Find Tiff. This is it. This is it. I've got a feeling. They've got nothing to back that feeling up. Okay, well, that was that was awful. We should win. Oh dear, no! What's the run? Oh, he's on. He's on because the right back. Oh, oh, what a block! Oh, what a clearance! That's the two centre backs for you, boys. <laughs> they are so good. <laughs> right from the corner. Last kick of the game. Unlucky. We'll take it. I'm done, Tiffany. I'm done. Unless everybody else's legs falls off. I don't want to see... Oh, shit. I don't want to see you on the... <laughs> it's 21 games, okay? Maybe you just need a season in the reserve. You're still obviously very young. I'm not going to sell you, but I'll... maybe it's time to go in the reserves. We've got the hopefully a new striker coming in. Four and a half grand. Uh, how's our finances looking? I need the board to add some money. It's so weird because I never do this. I never over. I'm re as you know. I'm really careful with ex expenses, generally when I'm at these little clubs. But now I'm in like fuck it mode. I want. I kind of want to test them just to see how much, how bad you can get it. Because I feel like they're just going to put money in. It's going to be fine. Right on to the next game. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll have a new striker. Welcome to the club, John McGlynn. Unfortunately, Alex Samuel chose one of the other teams. Tiffany, I think it's uh, just, you know, Tiff, you know, you're only 18 years old. Go, go, go to the under 23s, get plenty of game time. McGonagall's going to be back tomorrow. Uh, I'm in read for it. We've got a pretty settled squad. Paddy's back as well, which is good. Um, other than that, we're okay. We do have two games in like two days. Coventry Hannah Silver Mill. Okay, don't care. Gallagher's wanted by TNS. Total Network Solutions. That's it. This is good because we're going into the January transfer window and I don't want to have to or lose 
all my good young players. All right, straight into the mixer. I have just been... Okay, it's an outlandish bid, I've got to be honest, but my scouts suggested him. Uh, Brad Alt F4 is loan listed. So they've accepted a bid um, for him. And uh, so like, I don't... It's the one position I just don't at all need, but it's, you know, he's a legend and depth and... Oh, hang on, that's my... We're not... <laughs> I was like, who the fuck is Peck? He's one of them, isn't he? Right, here we go, he's taking it. Orozco, the centre-back, is okay. Just pings it in. Top bins, okay. That is his sixth goal of the season. He's probably my second or third top goal scorer. It's a great pen. Oh, don't save that. I was hoping the new guy might fancy it, but okay. We're going into the January transfer window. My plan is... Go on, go on, battle for it. My plan is... Just to go all out. I'm going to spend all the money if I can. I'm just going to get players in. Minor upgrades. Don't care about wages. As long as we can pay for them. Fine. I'm going to spend all the... Is he dead? <laughs> Straight red. Oh, caught with an elbow. Nasty. Um, yeah, I'm going to just spend it. If I find a good player, I'm going to... And I can pay him. I'm spending it. They gave me a budget. I'm not breaking any rules. I'm gate spending the budget that they gave me. They, you know, although we did fudge the budget a couple of years ago, but still they keep adding on to it, so it's their own fault. Right, this would have been perfect for Tiffany, wouldn't it? This game, ten men. Right, Logan. Here we go. There's one. Denim. Ninzi. Go on, Crane. Go on, Craney. Oh, he's done it again. Four for the season for Craney. Hurley with yet another assist. Remember my hatred for number 10s? For like four years of FM, I just never got them to work. And now he's my best, most important player. Big crowd here today. Right. Everybody good? Roscoe. Don't need to. Oh, do you want to see a bit of Falco? I don't like the fact that the new guy is complacent in his first game. Early. Not the best free kick. Not sure what that was. Felt like a bit of a pass back. Oh, mistakes were made. Oh, <laughs> ah, non league. Love non league. Absolute terrible defending, followed by a terrible bit of attacking. <laughs> we should, we should, we're 2 0 up. Red card. It's, it's fine. It's nice to see Crane. Oh, fuck. I, shouldn't have, I was just about to praise him, and then he just gives it away. It's nice to see Crane playing well because he's not, he's, on paper, he's not a bad player. <clears throat> oh, that's good. Rich Blake, easy, easy. He's not. He's not been called up to the under nineteens again yet. Come on, lads. They're playing quite well considering they've got ten men. Force them just to hoof it. There we go. Oh, Jesus, what's that pecker fella? Not bad. Oh, he's finished it. Lads, 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 lads. Come on. Focus. Don't know, I shouldn't just shout that. I should actually use the buttons in the game. Focus. Early. Go on, Lindsay. Deadly set pieces. It's so important at non-league level to have somebody that's half decent. I'm talking just double figures. But they give you so many goals. Okay, that's good. Come on, Falco. Come on, let's get a league goal this season, mate. Let's get a league goal. Early. Good 
good header away, but Crane's going to pick it up. He's on his favoured left, plays it back into Hurley, fires it across. Not enough on it, but he's battling for it. No foul. Okay. We just carry it on. Looks that way. I'm waiting for it to stop. You're not falling again. I'm not, I'm not biting on this. I feel like it. No, I think we actually are going. Crane's found himself on the right hand side now. Cuts back in on to his favourite left, but then uses his right foot. <laughs> like a like a genius he is. Uh, Paddy the Baddy's coming on. <sighs> Let's see it out. How's Falco doing? 6.5. You watching, Tiffany? That's that's a 6.5, yeah. Well done, boys. I think the red card helps a lot because I think they look quite dangerous before then. But then we've got the big the big times coming up. We've got a transfer window. I'm worried about our goalkeeper. I'm, I'm very much worried about how happy Christmas, by the way. Um, I'm worried about our goalkeeper being stolen. We do have a new goalkeeper because the other one had to go back. He's actually pretty good. So I'm, I'm happy for him to take over. Um, who else is a possibility? Maybe Matt Roberts. He's not wanted yet. We don't have... like Brad and Wolf were like another level. These are We've got good young players, but are good for our level. Um, I'm surprised neither of these two are being talked about. Because, you know, they've been pretty solid. Right, there we go. We are done. We are massively in debt. We're approaching the half million pound mark. So I'm I'm hoping for this. The trouble is they're going to start accepting any offer, aren't they? Like, they're going to accept five grand, like as if it makes a dent. Brilliant. Right, there we go. I'm sorry, Tiffany, if you're watching, but... <sighs> to be quite frank, you're shit. You know, I can't, I can't be around the bush. You're just... You're just a bit shit, but there's still time. Thank you very much. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.